already um, basically it's really easy if you're visiting Paris and you're worried about it there's pharmacies on every corner you just go in tell them that you're traveling and you need a COVID test and it costs 20 euro and you get your test and you come back in 15 minutes for your results which both of ours were negative thankfully so that's pretty cool we get to go home um, and we decided after our COVID test to come back to back in black coffee because we loved it so much the first time and we wanted to revisit some of the places that we really really liked and now we're sitting here trying to figure out what we're going to do for the rest of the day i think we're going to what do we talk about we were going to go to the luxembourg gardens um but it's kind of difficult to get there by metro so we're going to stop at jardin des plants see what that's all about and then i want to see a couple of emily in paris locations and then maybe Jardin de Luxembourg, and then we want to check out Montmartre neighborhood. And then tonight uh, we're gonna go sit by the water and watch the Eiffel Tower light up. So I think it'll be a good last day in Paris. How do you feel about leaving, Josh? Uh, <clears throat> I had a great time, and I'll be sad to leave, but it will be nice to be back in my own little space, in my own apartment, um, comfortable. I will look forward to returning. Yeah, agreed. I feel the same way. Gare d'Austerlitz. Gare d'Austerlitz. to say un croissant. That's Gabrielle's restaurant. And then the fountain over here. It's also close, how fun. The fountain where they have her uh, birthday. Her apartment is one of those. 
was at the very top. And that's where we often see her and Gabrielle run into each other and Camille. What do you think, Josh? Which one does Ross and Chandler live in? You're annoying. <laughs> from the dust storm. I think it's out. It's gone. Is it safe? <laughs> it's safe. You're silly. Oh, yeah, like that. See that? That just came towards us. Oh, here comes another. I decided to come back to the Luxembourg Gardens today because last time we were here several years ago, um, we were super hangry, like super, super hangry. I think it was probably like two in the afternoon and we hadn't even eaten lunch yet, so we were just... And we had been at, we had been at the catacombs, so we had been walking for a really long time, and then we got here and we were just... Up. We were done. We were done with it. And so we were in bad moods, but we could appreciate how beautiful the, the gardens is. I mean, come on. This is beautiful. So we wanted to come back and sit for a little while, read our books and appreciate the beauty that we didn't get to last time. your French onion soup. Oh my god. It's so good. I'm busy paying attention to the dogs. Look at our food dogs. This is the best spot. I'm happy.
Last day in Paris. No. We're just admiring this. You're in love. Nice place for me to go read my books. Yes. It looks like they have board games stacked up in there. They play board games. Update. <laughs> So I've been seeing Oops mayonnaise on all the menus here and so I thought it was some kind of fancy dish but it's it's literally just eggs with mayonnaise. Okay. Why aren't we dancing? Because we gotta be too bad. Yes, that's accurate. Hola. Hola. Bonjour. Bon Bonsoir. So we wanted to finish our trip, our very last night in Paris. Josh is jumpy because his phone is set up on the tripod behind us. Our very last night in Paris, we wanted to spend by the Seine, looking at the Eiffel Tower, waiting for it to light up because we came here in 2015 just for a couple of nights and we picked up some wine at the local probably monoprix some, some grocery yeah, yeah some grocery the, the little grocery store convenience stores and we sat down here and we we're like the eiffel tower is so pretty but like i thought it was more sparkly than that and we sat here and drinking our wine and then all of a sudden it, it lit up and i'm sure most people know it, it lights up sparkles every hour on the hour for about five minutes but we didn't know that and it lit up and it was just the most magical feeling and yeah, I, I, we can't relive that, but we can feel a little nostalgic by getting wine and sitting by the sun and, and trying again. We're gonna try. Yeah. Noel. Yes. Tell the people what we got to watch the show. We. Oui. Perfect. This is supposed to be like an orange <clears throat> cinnamon roll. I don't taste a lot of orange, but that's fine. Like I, I really, really love orange rolls, but I know you don't. So you were able to try this too and enjoy it, but it's really good. Probably my, one of my favorite things I've eaten since I've been here. Am I able to try it again? Okay. So we just got back from grabbing coffee and breakfast pastries at 10 Bells. 
as much as we would have loved to stay there because it was a really cool cafe. Like they had, it was a bakery. They had a lot of breads and it all looked really good. It would have been nice to sit there and hang out on our last morning. As much as we would have loved to do that, here's why we can't. Yeah, our place, whew, we got a lot of packing to do. So we came home instead. We're gonna work on this for a little bit. We're gonna try and get out uh, in the next couple hours and go get some early lunch, I guess, before we head to the train station to head to the airport to I head wanna, home. I want to croak madame. One more croak madame. Oui. Yeah, a lot better. All right, we were stressed. We thought we were late. When I mean, we just, when we make it to the to where our gate is, then we can actually relax. Yeah. yeah. Easy.